Hey guys, welcome to WatchGuard Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is WinRAR exploited in the wild. Today's story has two parts. One, to inform you that WinRAR has a new vulnerability you need to patch. And two, even more importantly, it's being exploited today in the wild. First of all, many of you might have heard of WinRAR. Similar to Zip or WinZip, it's a decompression uh, program that allows you to compress and decompress uh, different types of computing files to make them smaller. And RAR is just a different type of compression format than Zip. It is a pretty popular program and it has over 500 million users. And I would say I probably see it more often in people that share files, often illegally, but I have seen it used legitimately as well. Anyways, recently uh, the Checkpoint research team uh, has found a new vulnerability in WinRAR without going into all the technical details. Basically, a bad guy can create a archive or a compressed file that takes advantage of a vulnerability to execute a code on your computer. And this archive can actually still work as an archive, but without you knowing, it's actually adding a program to your computer, putting it in the startup so that next time you reboot your computer, it might install a backdoor on your computer. That was discovered by Checkpoint a while ago. WinRAR has fixed this problem. If you get the latest version of WinRAR, which I believe is 5.70, you will have a patch for this problem. But today's story also involves research from a Chinese research group which is called Kihu 360 By the way, I'm probably uh, murdering the pronunciation of that particular company's name, but Kihu is how I would pronounce it. Anyways, those researchers found attackers leveraging this vulnerability days after it was disclosed in the wild. The main campaign they focused on is an email that seems to be spreading in the Asia Pacific region, probably mostly in China. Now this email has an archive that contains attractive female pictures and those pictures are the lure to get users to open the archive in this email. But again, if you open that archive, it's actually installing files on your computer as well as a, a startup command so that when you next restart your computer, you're going to get a backdoor. Now, the Kihu researchers also noticed uh, some targeted attacks in the Middle East using the same issue, but it was an archive containing, I believe, a PDF file. In any case, if you use WinRAR, be aware of this flaw. Go get 5.70 and patch it immediately. And if you get any weird emails with RAR files, those are probably pretty uh, unusual for business. I don't think RAR is used very often in the business context. So you should avoid opening those files. Better yet, you can even use products like the Firebox and our proxies to block all RAR files from entering via email or the web. That's it for today's Security Byte. Thank you for watching.